<laughs> Hi, everybody. <sighs> it is Saturday, and yesterday I had my second dose of the vaccine. So in 13 more days from today, I am officially vaccinated, which means technically I should be allowed to travel when the restrictions end and all that kind of stuff. I have my printout saying I have been vaccinated. I have it on the date. It's by the Ontario Health uh, Science Center. So I'm all set. But people have asked, what kind of reaction did you get? And this one was different than my first dose. Okay, this one definitely made my arms sore compared to the last time. The last time I hardly noticed anything. This time it's very, very tender in the area. And also about 3 a.m. in the morning, I just felt hot. Like very, yeah, I felt hot. <laughs> no, I felt very, very warm. And... Uh, I don't know if it's just like we're going through a heat wave here in, in Ottawa right now. It's like 95, 100 degrees every day the last few times. We, we're being told to ration our water. So that's how much of a, uh, in Canada, we have, we have billions and billions and billions of gallons of water. Uh, but we're told to ration it because the water levels are going down quite rapidly. So, yeah, I have a, I don't know if I got hot because of that or it's just a hot day. Uh, and then throw that on the top of the arm being tender when I like to sleep kind of like this or like this on my side. I made it, I could only sleep on this side and I had to put a pillow under it to keep it from, you know, in a right place where it didn't feel tingly. It just, I, but that's really all the way it is. I don't feel anything else. I don't have headaches. I don't have you know, I'm not running a fever. I checked this morning. Uh, it's just hot. And I think, uh, judging by this, it's like 8.30 here in the morning. And uh, the sun is shining. And uh, I had to close the blinds because my office, the windows, the sun was just cooking me sitting at my table, my computer this morning. So anyone who's wondering, I got the Moderna vaccine. Didn't feel too, too much was a, a sore arm but other than that and a little bit hot i'm i'm getting better now i don't like there's nothing tingly there's nothing anything like that so i i'll take it i'll take it to be able to travel i'll, I'll suck that one up boy I'll, I'll 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 be in my room for 14 days if i have to uh with these chills and a sore arm so i can get back to job to traveling but i wanted to say i I've, i'm getting quite a few things in the mail uh, you know, from my Cruising with Dawn channel and some people are sending it to uh, movie related with my nephews and this channel here. Uh, but I got some, you know, most of them send it to my, my, my mailing address that I have underneath the videos. I have a, a box with UPS and they hold all my packages for me. And because, you know, this isn't my house. This is, uh, you know, I rent this house. So I don't give out my home address. I gave out my apartment address when I used to live at the apartment because, you know, I was there and it's a secured building and all that, but uh, I don't like to give out my home address here because um, you never know if that one guy who dislikes every one of my videos is going to track me down. <laughs> but something very strange came in the mail. Uh, a UPS driver dropped something at my door and it was addressed to me with my address and I said what did I order I, I like I know what I order did I order something and forget and uh, and then uh, this came in it's uh I guess it's supposed to be like a relaxing thing for under your head and inside there's those little round 
there's one of these in there and then you had the foam rubber thing on top and there's no name on it. There's no address on it. A return address, there's no nothing. And I didn't order it. Um, that's for sure. I, I had no idea what it was. I had to look up what it was, so there's no way I ordered it. I went, just in case, I went back on Amazon and checked <laughs> like seven months of ordering. Now it wasn't me. And my son is hooked up to my Amazon account as well. And I was making sure he, because he, you know, exercises. Maybe this was something because he had a sore neck or something because he works in construction. And nope, nope, he didn't order it neither because I could see what he ordered. And, uh, and he's in much better shape than I am, so I don't think he needs anything. So I just found it very, very strange that this came to my address with my name on it. Because I don't give out this address. And I have no idea who would send me that. <laughs> so if you send it to me, please email me. Please email me and let me know, hi, Don, I sent it to you. I thought you, know, you might be a little stressed and, you know, you were things like this. This might help you de-stress and relax and stuff like that. And uh, great. At least I would know why it came here because, <laughs> you know, it, it might be very useful. I don't know. I don't even know really what it is. It's, uh, you know, it's an eco-friendly massage neck pillow and mis like peanut ball or something in it. But it's pretty funny that there's no return address. There's mail directly to my house and it's in UPS. So please, uh, and you know what? Maybe somebody sent me something. I thought to myself, maybe somebody sent me something and then ordered something for themselves. And it, you know, they forgot to change the address and it came to me, you know, because on Amazon, you can choose the address of where to deliver it to me. So if that happened and you accidentally delivered it to me and you want it back, email me. I'll mail it back to you. No problem. Um, it's unused <laughs> and I've been vaccinated. So you're safe. Um, but then I thought about that and I said, yeah, but even if they did that, I didn't give out my home address to anybody. Nobody knows this home address. So it's a mystery. <laughs> it's, it's a mystery, but, uh, one worth solving, I think one worth solving. And, uh, well, one more quick thing tonight. I am doing a live stream on my Cruising with Dawn channel. I'm hoping to have Tony, who's on the Adventure of the Seas today. He's getting on board. See what that like. Uh, and I'm going to talk about all the travel that I've started booking since I knew when I was getting my vaccine shot. I don't know. Uh, I don't know if I'm uh, going to be living in Canada too much longer. With they might as well just consider me, you know, on the open seas as my new home address. <laughs> Good luck getting that sent to me <laughs> in the middle of the ocean.